first, <clears throat> how many of you have heard of Taylor Swift? Okay. She's this filthy, lewd entertainer who travels the world with barely anything on. And she's starting a world tour right now where she expects to net something over a billion dollars for herself. Here's how she does it. <clears throat> All these young girls who are called Swifties want to hear her. They want, to, they want to be there. They want to be associated with Taylor Swift. Now, the least expensive ticket to go to her concert, the least expensive just to get in the door and be up in Nosebleed Alley is $1,147 per teenager. 13 to 17 year olds. I've got to go, Mom. I've got to go. I've got to be there, Dad. You got to. Okay. Now, if you want to be anywhere close to her, the ticket is four to five thousand dollars. That's the going prices. We're not talking about people on the street. <clears throat> if you want to be right up close to her, then the ticket price is over eleven thousand dollars. And they make sure that you know there are no fees attached to this. So it's all it all goes to her. Now in order to get to this concert, because she's touring the world, in order to get to this concert, you have the privilege of paying $113 to park a minimum of a mile away. So you're going to walk two miles to hear her sing these 44 songs. And when you're there, to buy water, if you get thirsty, it's $10. If you want a Taylor Swift thermal mug, it's $15. If you want to buy a beer, it's $20. If you want a, if you want a Taylor t-shirt, it's $45. And a Taylor hoodie, it's $75. And you have these kids begging their father to go take out a mortgage if he has to, so to speak, so I can be there. And they're depressed and they almost can't eat and think if they can't go see Taylor Swift rob their, fa their parents. And it creates a, a family dynamic that's horrific.